Hey everyone, I hope you've had a great weekend so far. I'm really sad it's coming to an end. It's now, what's the time? Five to five here in England. So yeah, weekend is nearly over. So sorry to be depressing, but we all know it's true. Anyway, I thought I would do a video today on a bit of a um, chit chat, a bit of a catch up. Um, got some news for you guys, some information to give you and I'm really excited because the main point of this video is to show you two clutch bags which I got fairly recently, one of them only yesterday so very recently and I'm seriously loving and they're going to be my staple sort of party season bags for this obviously festive Christmas season coming up so I wanted to share those with you in case like me you struggle sometimes using the perfect bag, all these parties you're going to or um dinners or bars you know you don't really a lot of my bags are big oversized day bags and that's not really the look you want to be going for when you're just having a night out with friends you just want to have a bit of a boogie on the dance floor and you've got this huge bag it's just not ideal um so yeah hopefully they'll help you out so really quickly um just to let you know because people might want to know I, I do get questions asking below which is really sweet um quite sort of natural on my face today i've only got concealer where i need it um, you probably won't see because of the lighting, like the time of night it is now. Um, I've basically got Benefits Coilist the blush on my cheekbones, which I love that blush. It's so, um, it's actually really summery, but even this time of year I still love it. It just gives a nice flush of colour to your cheeks and it's really flattering. Um, my lips are a mixture of really old um, Viva Glam Gaga um, lipstick, the first one she did, like the bubblegum pink. I still love it, it's practically gone now, um, but I'm gonna miss it when it's finished. And then over the top of that, I've just got a lip gloss, um, what is it? It's one which is from the States, and it's basically, I've forgotten what it's called, that's really annoying. Um, and it's basically like a, I think it's made by a toothbrush brand, which might sound really bizarre, but it's just a really pretty baby pink, but it's really minty. So it just helps, it just like cases really nice on your lips and is meant to like, you know, keep your mouth feeling fresh and clean. So it's nice. So if I keep doing that in the video, it's because it tastes really yummy. Um, yeah, and just on my eyes, I'm wearing a um, metallic red from Topshop, from a trio pod um, I got called when the Topshop line first launched maybe a year ago now. Um, I don't think they sell it anymore unfortunately but I love it. It was basically a quad with three metallics in, dark navy gold and this red and some people might think god like a red shimmer eyeshadow against red hair might be too much but I actually think it's really flattering and it actually brings out the red of my hair more so I'm really enjoying that at the moment. Um, what have I got? Rings. I've just got this one which a friend gave me which is from a local boutique where we live. This is Topshop layered leather and gold chain bangles. This you've all seen before is vintage and this I guess is kind of vintage. It was my Nana's. So yeah and then my necklace is Forever 21 which you've seen in a haul video before and I'm just really casual today. I've just got on a long sleeve sort of um, oat colour top from Topshop and then just my furry gelée from Topshop as well. So yeah, um, the first thing I just wanted to tell you all really quickly, I know I mentioned it in my last video, but I'll put the link below, is um, my blog and my channel, I guess, has got a Facebook page now um, for the Fashion Tellers Notes, and when I get to 100 followers on there, I'm going to do a really big giveaway, which I'm really excited about. I've already started buying some bits for it. Um, so yeah, as soon as I reach 100, that giveaway will be posted. I'll talk about it obviously on the Facebook page and on my channel here. So I'll put the link below. So I'd really appreciate it if you could go like my Facebook page. So that will basically be the place to go to see my latest blog post links, my latest video links. Um, and I'll be doing giveaways and little mini reviews maybe on Facebook. I really want to get my Facebook page going. Um, Facebook is just as good as Twitter. I know it's not as easy and as quick as Twitter just to reply to people, but I still love Facebook and think it's really good for, you know, interacting with people and with what you do. So yeah, that's one thing I wanted to tell you. Another thing I wanted to tell you before I show you the bags is that I'm getting a lot of interest, which is so exciting, and a huge um, compliment on my jewellery for my jewellery line I've got, which is called Sara Secret. So the website is basically being worked on at the moment and is hoping to launch January 2012. So new year, new start, new jewellery. Um, but what I'm doing in the meantime, which I've already done, some people have purchased and their orders will be sent out next week, is um, I'm basically listing anything I've made and I'm gonna sell on my blog. 
So again, I always do, but I'll put the link below to my blog, and basically that's where I'll post pictures and prices on things I've designed. Um, and I'm so excited, because hopefully by the end of this week coming, I'm going to post some amazing heavy curb chain necklaces on there. Um, some will just be plain heavy chains, obviously I can make them to the you know to what you guys need I can customize pieces and um, some of them will be heavy curved chains but then with like big Swarovski crystals hanging off them so very fierce pieces which I think you could work during the daytime and in the evening and um, also if you're going to go for quite a simple but elegant dress or skirt and top combo this party season a big statement necklace like that especially with the Swarovski crystals on will just look stunning and I'm so excited to share them with you all I've got every confidence in them so I hope you guys like them as much as I like them and the people that have seen them so far like them so that was the other piece of news I wanted to share um also this is just really random but for those of you that like have followed my channel and my blog for ages now you know that I'm a big bookworm I love reading and I've just started reading this book to get me into the festive season. So it's called Miracle on Regent Street. Regent Street, if you don't know, it's a very famous street in London, um, right near Oxford Street, really, and it's got amazing shops and restaurants down there. So, yeah, this looks really good. It's by Ali Harris. Um, so, yeah, that's a random... I just wanted to show you all because I talk books quite a bit on Twitter and thought I'd let you know what I'm currently reading. Um, I have got a Kindle, and I love it. This feels really funny, reading a proper book. Obviously, it's always lovely reading a traditional book um, but I'm so used to my Kindle but my mum's currently stolen it because she's reading a book on it and wants to see what she thinks about the Kindle in case she wants to purchase one for herself so I've gone back to the traditional way of reading. So on to the video you probably care the most about now, sorry for that little ramble. Um, I'm going to quickly show you the two clutch bags that I've got and that I believe will carry me through from now way into the new year and I mean I'd even use them next year but one of them particularly is very festive. Um, and both can be used for a daytime look or an evening look. So the first one I'm going to show you is by a brand um, called Luna Wong. And this is the dust bag. It comes in a really nice quality velvet drawstring dust bag. Um, I don't know if they're stocked anywhere here in the UK. They might be in the US, but this was from online. And I'll put the web link below. You should definitely go check it out. They're very sleek, clean, classic bags, leather bags, really good quality. Um, and this is the clutch bag and this is the colour I chose which is like the orange um, mustardy colour now unfortunately the lighting's probably not going to pick it up that's probably the true colour there if I bring it really close it's going to go very bright so if I hold it back here that's probably what the colour looks like and it's a big very soft it's so soft leather oversized envelope clutch bag so you've got the popper detailing here and then inside is so luxurious it's suede detailing all the way down and um, there's no pockets or compartments inside um, but really with clutch bags I don't think you particularly need them you can but it's really easy to see what you're carrying in your clutch bag um, I absolutely love this this is the brand embossed here Luna Wong and what I love about this is that this will take me from season to season. I've worn this now sometimes to work when I haven't got to like, take a lot with me, a pair of jeans, a classic shirt or t-shirt tucked in, this and my furry jacket and I'm ready to go. Um, it's also really good for evenings out if I'm going to a cinema or out for dinner and I don't need to, I don't really need to take a lot with me um, but I still have the odd essentials like my keys, my phone, lipstick. So this is the perfect size. It's not too small but I can't fit anything in it which makes me frustrated. Some clutch bags are like teeny tiny and it's just a bit pointless this is just the right size and I think it's just very chic um, it really reminds me of something a designer would do it really reminds me of something um, Celine would do obviously that would be in the thousands um, this like I said I'll list everything below because I can't remember 100% how much this was but I'll put the website link below and you can check it out it is in dollars and um, so I'll hold it up against me just to give you an idea of the sizing compared to the rest of my body So, this is what it's like. So, yeah, gorgeous, gorgeous bag. Can't recommend it enough. Um, really chic. I've already got a couple of the girls at work ordering these in um, different colours as well. So, it must be doing something right. It does get um, people asking where it's from. So, that was my Luna Wong gorgeous orange leather clutch bag. 
the next clutch bag, which I got yesterday, which is much more um, festive season. The reason I wanted to show you two is that that one is for people who maybe aren't into all the um, embellishment, all the glitter, all the sequins, which is nothing wrong with that. I personally love that. Or you might have a really embellished, quite dressy, sparkly outfit, so you don't want to go too, too OTT with really um, extravagant accessories. So that would look gorgeous against like a, I don't know, bronze glittery top or dress. So that's just an understated clutch, which you can use again and again. This I got yesterday from Zara. Love Zara. There's so many pieces in there yesterday I could have brought, but I've got to be good with my money for Christmas at the moment. Um, but this was such a good price. It was only 29.99, And it's this gorgeous gold sequin clutch. This has got to be one of my favourite bags I probably own now. And for the price, like I said, 29.99, I think that's a really good price. It's really nice quality. It's really plushy sequins all over it and um, they did it in like a black pewter almost sequin as well which I loved I was really torn between the both but I picked the gold um, just because I thought it stood out a bit more and it's obviously very festive Um, I love it so it's got a zip fastening at the top and then I'll just take the tissue paper out inside is a purple lining a rich purple lining and then this one um, not like the Luna Wong one has got actually compartments in it, I don't know if you can see, but you've got a mobile phone compartment there, and you've also got bits where you can put your cards, so that's quite handy. If you don't need to take a purse with you to take up room or weight in this, you can just put the cards you need in there and you're ready to go. Um, I just think this is absolutely stunning, and um, it really reminds me of something Mulberry would do as well. They're really into sequins and embellishments, and you know, for £29.99, I don't think you could go wrong. So I'll hold this against me as well, just so you can see the sizing compared to my body. So, this is this one. So, yeah. Quite a bit smaller than the other one, the Luna One one, but still a really good size, quite deep. Obviously the only um, disadvantage of this one is because it's a dark lining inside, that one was a light suede, so it was really clear to see what was in your bag, and it wasn't as um, deep, whereas this one is. But then I guess some people might say this is more secure, I don't know. So yeah, that's my Zara clutch. Um, I'll put the link, I'm sure you all know the Zara website, but just in case, I'll put the link below as well. Um, yeah, so really love both of those, really happy with them. Again, the Luna Wong orange one, orange mustard leather, I would use evening and daytime. This is obviously perfect for the Christmas parties and Christmas outings you have. But again, I would easily use this during the day. I think it's so cute with a pair of like shorts or jeans and a jumper. It adds a bit of sparkle and a bit of magic to your look and that's never a bad thing. So yeah, they're the two clutches I wanted to share, um, let me know what you think of them, if you've got them already, what your bag for the party season is going to be, I know that everyone talks outfits, which I am going to do a video on soon because I've got a few different occasions this year for Christmas outings, so I've got different dresses and different looks and if you guys are interested I'll do a video showing you what I'll be wearing on each occasion or maybe like a blog post on my blog. Um, but yeah, I'd love to know what you guys all think and remember to check out my Facebook page and like it and look out for the giveaway which I'm so excited about, there's some really cool prizes. Um, yeah, I'll speak to you all soon, have a good week, bye!